Along with our regular kook chores. Which one's your exchangee? That him? No, Kira said he's a dog. He's from the city. He's probably a bit out of shape, wearing a suit, not outdoorsy. <gasps> like that guy. <laughs> oh, good. He looks quiet. And clean. Guess that's not him. All right, I'm off to the big litter-filled city. Now remember... Go, have fun. Don't take any lip from... We've got it covered. Good luck. Bye. Hey, I'm Prince. Here is Fred. You must be Iggy and Jiggers, my exchange host. Hop on. Nice ride. I'm alive. I'm alive. Hey, everybody, this is Prince, our very first exchangee. Hello, everybody. How you doing, ladies? <sighs> Oh, don't worry, they'll be okay. It happens all the time. Kira's been raving about how great the kook is. I just had to see it for myself. <sighs> and get in touch with my inner canine. This guy would be the perfect poster boy for my new gym. And I have a feeling that after hanging out with you two, I'll never want to leave. <laughs> That's exactly what I'm planning. <laughs> Look at this. Spiff's only gone a few minutes, and already there's trash everywhere. I'll take care of it, Stu. Right after I check the River Whoosh Delta, clear fallen rocks from Rattler's Pass, harvest moss and the heebie-jeebies, fix a rail car track, and mine all mine, and... No littering! Sorry. Uh, <laughs> welcome to Moose Knuckle. Hmm. <laughs> the biggest rest. Yeah, he needs a break. I'm on it. If he can do Spiff's job, I bet he can do Iggy's. What do you think of a keeper of the kook exchange, but permanent? <laughs> ah. Ah. Clearing rocks and Rattler's Pass? This is almost as good as working out with free weights. Where to now? Mine all mine. You up for it? <laughs> it's that way, right? Wow, great nose. Yeah, I know. Like one Iggy isn't enough. <laughs> You're in great shape for a city dog. I hit the gym every day, so this is the breeze. <laughs> oh, but running on actual earth instead of a treadmill? It's indescribable. Aha. Keeper of the kook requirements. Physically fit? Check. <sighs> huh? I think I pulled the tail muscle. There it is, the broken track. Mm. Let's hurry up and get out of here. You okay, big guy? Yeah, no, just a, just a bit claustrophobic. How about you? It's pretty closed in down here. I'm used to it. Reminds me of the subway back home. Fearless? Chuck. Did you hear that? No. <gasps> Exceptional hearing? Chuck. saving us 
from that runaway rail car, Prince, I hereby declare you an honorary pig ranger. Ta-da! Oh, it was nothing, really. Oh, don't be modest. I'm very impressed. Matter of fact, I'm so very impressed, I think you should be our new keeper of the kook. What? what? Oh, uh, <laughs> the pigs had a long and noble run here. But doesn't the poor little porker deserve a break? I don't need a break. Oh, yeah? Look at you. You have unsightly bags <laughs> under your eyes. You're pale. Your skin is blotchy and you look tired. I'm not <laughs> tired. I'm fine. Really? Then tell me, what would happen if Prince hadn't been there to save you at the mine today, huh? So, Prince, what do you say? Uh, um, thanks, but I, I don't think so. Huh? Don't get me wrong, the idea of working outside sounds great, but Iggy's definitely your guy. <laughs> oh. <sighs> Prince has been howling out there for 36 minutes. Why can't he meditate or do yoga like a normal city animal? Because he's getting in tune with nature. Actually, he's a little off-key. I think he sounds perfect. He's got great hearing. He's a dog. They have sharp ears. And his sense of smell? Oh. Again, he's a dog. I, I was just thinking, he probably would be a great keeper of the kook. I knew it. I knew Stu's speech was getting to you. No, it's not Stu. I just want what's best for the kook. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. <laughs> I know I smell fish. Excellent nose. All the more reason you should consider this. What do you think? Top dog for the job? <laughs> That's true. But you already have a top pig. <sighs> he tries between you and me. This whole keeper of the kook thing has become too much for him. He was supposed to go to the wet wally weeks ago to check out a slate for my new gym. That's what this place needs. I love going to the gym. Well, so would everyone else here. <sighs> if they had one. <gasps> Here's a thought. Why don't you scout it out yourself? Well, that is my area of expertise, among other things. You could go early tomorrow morning and be back before he even wakes up. <laughs> okay, I'll do it. Easy to manipulate? Check. <laughs> With him as the new keeper, I'll finally be able to turn this whole park into one big money-making machine. <laughs> Doesn't he ever stop? It's not Prince. It's the howler monkeys in the wet wally. Why are they howling so early? <gasps> there could only be one reason. Someone's trespassed onto their territory. I'll get all rusty. That howling fork you put on is my only way of communicating with the monkeys. Go wake Prince. He's gone. I think this has something to do with Prince's disappearance. Sponsored by Catfish Stew's Iggy Be Gone campaign. Oh, I'll bet you Stu put Prince up to something in the wet wally. We have to hurry. Prince must have wandered in there without howling for permission. Prince! Prince! Up here! I don't get it. I tried communicating with these monkeys, but for some reason, I don't think they like me. The only thing these howler monkeys hate more than trespassers is barking. I have to go get him. But you need to ask for permission first. That's why I brought the howling for. <laughs> You saved my life. No problem. Uh, guys, I seem to have uh, 
clap myself into a hole? Prince for Keeper of the Coop. Take a button. Free buttons. Forget it, Stu. Prince is just here for the weekend. Well, I have a finny feeling he might just stay for good. Well, I have a <clears throat> finny feeling. You're wrong. You know, Stu, everyone, the kooks already got the best keeper it could ever have. Oh, yeah? What about all your amazing abilities? My hearing, my sense of smell huh? is a dog thing. But, but, Stu, Iggy had to rescue me today. Think about it. He knows stuff about nature. It would take me a lifetime to learn. I'm from the city, remember? What about the buttons? Prince, you're welcome back here anytime. And I will be back. Ta-ta, ladies. Bye, everyone. Hey, look what I got. The city's amazing. Litter everywhere. Look at this. A takeout taco box. Welcome home, Spiff. And these dozens of please don't litter posters. They're everywhere. I'll tell you what else is everywhere. People who look very, very bizarre. 